Welcome to the Maryland Suburbs Market Watch, brought to you by Real Estate Business Intelligence and MRIS Company. Let's examine the most recent numbers from the Maryland Suburbs housing market, which includes these areas. In September, the U.S. economy added 114,000 jobs and the unemployment rate dipped to 7.8 percent. On October 11th, it was announced that new unemployment applications fell to 339,000, the lowest level in four and a half years. The rate of job growth continues to be fairly modest. However, the drop in the unemployment rate was seen as good news that more people were finding jobs. The U.S. economy will continue to improve slowly and steadily in the fall, despite the headwinds of the economic situation in the European Union and the political uncertainty here at home. The national housing market continues to show signs of improvement. According to data from RealtyTrack, U.S. foreclosure filings dropped to a five-year low in September. Home prices are stabilizing and rising in many markets, and construction activity is up. The rate of job growth in the Maryland suburb slowed this month. The region added about 4,200 jobs over the past 12 months, a pace of job growth that is lower than recent months. The unemployment rate in the Maryland suburbs remained unchanged at 6.1 percent and is still significantly lower than the national unemployment rate. Sales activity has slowed in the Maryland suburbs housing market but still remains stronger than last year. There were 1,339 sales in September, well below the 10-year average for the month, but 2.4 percent higher than this time last year. While September was a slower month for sales, new pending contracts performed relatively well. There were 1,952 new pending contracts, which is 3.7 percent gain on last year, and the highest September total the region has seen in seven years. The inventory of homes for sale continues to decrease. There were 4,459 active listings at the end of September, 41.6 percent lower than this time last year, and over 3,000 below the 10-year September average for the area. The 2019 listings for the month are 14 percent lower than last year and the lowest September total on record. At 265000 the median sales price is up 15.2 percent from a year ago, an increase of $35,000. The low inventory continues to play a role in these price gains. Homes are also selling faster. The median days on market is 33 days, 24 days lower than this time last year. The Maryland suburbs housing market appears to be following seasonal patterns, though overall market activity has improved from last year. The low market inventory should keep prices relatively stable even as demand cools as we approach the end of the year. That's the Maryland Suburbs Market Watch for this month. Check back next month for the latest.